All right, so this is a suggestion via a donation. The name of the video is uh, Judge Rules That a White Girl Will Be Tried as a Black Adult. A Black Adult. <laughs> judge Rules. A Judge Rules White Girl Will Be Tried as Black Adult. Guys, keep in mind, guys, I'm, I'm not the one that generally puts the links up here for me, so I don't really see these until I actually have to, bro. But this title, the title of this video, bro. Let's jump into it, guys. <laughs> let's, let's, let's do it. I'm sorry for the long delayed introduction. This is the Onion News Network, keeping you safe from the lies. Tonight with an update on a story we've been following all week. Hannah Stevenson, the 16-year-old girl from Detroit, accused of stabbing a classmate to death with a screwdriver last month. At her arraignment this afternoon, Hannah received the harshest possible sentencing from the judge. She will be tried as a black adult. Due to the extreme and violent nature of this crime, this court finds it fitting to try the defendant as an African-American. Henceforth, you will be referred to for the jury by the name Bondell Brown. <laughs> Once the trial begins next week, all courtroom images of Hannah will depict her as a 300-pound muscular black man, and jury members will be instructed to imagine her as such. <laughs> okay. All right. Um, <laughs> guys, this is this is weird. Right. This is weird, guys. We're going to do our best to make sure that Hannah is treated with the sympathy and sensitivity that she, as a photogenic white girl, deserves. This is America. Nobody deserves to be treated as a black man. Now that Hannah has been ruled black, the court has instructed local media to assume she's guilty, and the police have retroactively charged her with assaulting her arresting officer. Hannah's two dozen character witnesses have been replaced by a single crack who goes by the name of Skaggs. Hannah's parents are, of course, planning to appeal the ruling, saying that their daughter should at most be tried as a black celebrity or a stunningly beautiful Filipino lady. Every time I hear a story like that, it makes me so glad I'm exempt from the legal system. <laughs> when you follow Fact Zone's Brooke Alvarez, you're following the news anchor with more stars than any other major network on-screen personality. If you're watching Brooke Alvarez, you're not alone. Fact Zone on the Onion News Network. Guys, um, where do we where do we start? <laughs> where do we start with this, guys? I I was I was just instantly drawn in. It sucked me in. Um, <laughs> I yeah. Well, that just happened. Uh, I don't know where it, they said this was in Detroit, guys. I <laughs> I'm uncomfortable. <laughs> All right, um. All right, so so this can't be real. If this is real, I don't even know where to begin with the. If the, okay, let's just say this is real. Um, no, it can't be real. <laughs> I just that's just this is going to no. We I can't even give you like a thought experiment, guys, because the thought experiment would would be just wild. This is just, this, guys. <laughs> I, 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 enough of the internet for today, guys. Enough, enough internet for today, guys. All right, that's that's it. You guys all have an absolutely amazing day. Um, yeah.